Right, hey everyone, it's Phil for Live Darts TV. We're here at the Potters um, Resort for the JDB event and we're joined by the legendary Phil Taylor. Phil, Thank thanks for taking time out for joining us. You're welcome, no worries. So, retirement, are you enjoying it more, first of all? I'm enjoying retirement. Yeah. I haven't retired yet, I'm still working. So I'm, I'm quite busy. I've been doing a few gigs here and there. I've been, been Australia and New Zealand and I've, I've loved it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm not under the pressure, like, you know, I can enjoy it more now. I say we saw on social media the Australia tour. It looks as if you had a great time down under. It was good, yeah. The weather was nice. You know, when we were when we were phoning back home and FaceTiming or whatever they call it, it was all snowy and icy and it was horrible. But we were in the sun. I say the game we saw you against Dimitri, which looked an unbelievable game for the yeah. neutral. Like, it could have been a televised final. You played brilliant, the lad did. Yeah, I forgot about that till he reminded me. Of. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's a good player. I like him as well. He's, he's one of my favourites. He is. So since you've um, packed up, have you kept an eye on the darts at all, or have you sort of like washed your hands of professional darts? Um, I'll, I'll look at the scores now and again. I don't really sit and watch darts, I'll be honest. You know, I flick. I'll look at the scores and I'll flick over. And, then, and if, if I'm not out anywhere, then I'll look at the scores, flick over again, you know what I mean? I, I've been watching it for 30 years, so well, maybe longer than that, about 40 years. Obviously the Premier League's just finished. Did you catch any of it this year? Little bits. Flicking, as I say, flicking. Did you miss it? No, no, not one bit. No, I, I saw Gary a few times and was taking the Mickey. You know what I mean? How tired he was and how much travelling they're doing. I was like, keep, keep it coming. Now, I suppose that's one thing the travelling that you don't miss at all. I still travel. I do still travel, but I'm not got to be here, there, and everywhere at a certain time. I can just get there really as and when I want to. So you know, like the Premier League, you've got to be there the day before. Whereas now, I just get there when when I'm working. No, definitely. Obviously, we're going to take you back to Ali Pali. Mm. The final obviously didn't go well, but walking off that stage for the last time, what was the overriding emotion that you it felt? It was lovely. It was fantastic. So people waving to me, you know, people singing along with me. You know, the press said I stormed off stage. Why I don't know, but no, it was lovely. It was, it was a nice send off for me. I say, I'm, I'm Rob, even though he'd won it, it was a lovely touch yeah. for, for you as well. Yeah, he's a nice kid, him. I hope he does well. You know what I mean? He's got a he's got a big target on his back now because everybody wants him because he's world champion. And I think he's handled the pressure quite well. I mean, for his first year, he, he's done brilliant. I say, it was a fairy tale for Rob come out of nowhere and he just got his tour card to win the biggest prize of them all, a bit like yourself back It went in. his way. I mean, he, I, I mean, Rob would be the first one to say he was very fortunate, you know, Michael Smith. How he won that game, I don't know, because Smithy played absolutely superb. Best I've ever seen him play. And he just made the odd double. Michael missed doubles that for him, you know what I mean? And, and it just was, was his week, it's how it goes. Next year, you know, he could go out first round or he could win it again. You just, it's, it's so close now. No, definitely. And moving forward, we've got Blackpool on the horizon. We know it's one of your favourite tournaments. Yeah. Does part of you want to go back and defend the title just a little bit? No, 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 no. I, and, I, and I say this with all honesty, no, I don't. I don't miss it at all. I, you know, I did it for so many years, and I had to be so dedicated. I'm not dedicated now. You know, I don't get up in the morning and, and do what I used to do. I've, I've chilled out now. You know, I, I practice maybe ten minutes a week. You know what I mean? I could do with doing a little bit more, to be honest with you. But I, do, I don't know. I'm, I'm not dedicated. It's it's very difficult to be dedicated year in, year in, year out. You know what I mean? It's 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 hard work. It's it's you know it's your life. You have to dedicate your life to it. Otherwise, you can't compete. Well, I guess in the dedication side of it as well, that's where some of the youngsters fall down, where yourself were at the top for so long because you were dedicated. Yeah, and no, I think it's the right time. I'm 58 this, this August, and I'm lucky. I'm on me. I just lost one of my friends, as you know, Eric, and, and I, I don't want to go down that path. I want to, you know, start looking after myself a bit now and whatnot, because I can and, and, and enjoy my life and what I've got left of it. You touched on it there. We lost a dying legend yeah. not, not so long ago. Um, where were you when you found the news and had um, I was in bed. I was in bed. And uh, funny enough, the Premier League was on, and I could hear somebody singing. There's only one Eric Risto, and I'm thinking, what's he done? <laughs> who's he? Who's he had to go at or whatever? And then um, I hadn't got my phone on, and then my house phone was ringing, and I knew then something was wrong. So I went down, and they got the news then. I was going to say iconic. I miss him. I do miss him. You know what I mean? We used to text each other. We didn't, you know, see each other that very often, but we used to text a lot. So you know what I mean? He gave me, he gave me telling off. I haven't been told off for the last five months. <laughs> now obviously you had that almost father and son figure with him for all those years from back in I the day. I think a lot of brothers really, a lot of brothers, you know what I mean? We didn't always get on, don't get me wrong. Bobby George made me laugh because I knew Eric for 45 years. I only ever liked him for three. <laughs> that was Bobby George for you. 
Um, but yeah, we, we, we had his fallouts like anybody does, you know. I mean, Eric could fall out with himself, no mind than me, but I loved him. No, definitely. Moving forward, obviously, plenty of gigs for yourself. Anything else in the pipeline away from darts that you're looking to get involved in? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. A few other things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Obviously, nice spending time with the family, I'm guessing, as well, now, where you can spend time at home. Yeah, I go home tonight and I've got four or five days off, which is great, which I've never had that, you know what I mean? I had four days off a bit before and a couple of weeks off a few weeks ago. It's, it's been, you know, I'm having at least four or five days a week off now, and it's lovely. So when you get to do stuff that you never got to do yeah, before? Yeah, I've, I've got a bike. I've got my bike every day. I do 20, 30 mile on my bike. It's great. I absolutely love it, as long as the weather's okay. I so say you've touched on the fitness regime. Is that still going really well, keeping yourself nice and active? I'm all right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I tend to, if I, if I do a lot of walking, it hurts me up a little bit. I'm too, too heavy yet. So I tend to do more, less stress on, you know, like rowing. I'll do rowing or I'll do cycling and also start going down swimming. Obviously, again, just going back to the dark side of it, is there anyone that you've got your eye on that you think could come through and take over the mantle and break into the, the top? The one I'd love to see do well is Dimitri, funny enough. You mentioned him earlier. I'd love him to, to do well. But there's loads of nice players. You know, Josh Payne, I think, is great for the game. Um, but they're all much and much the same, really. You know, the standard's that high. You know, you miss one double and you're out. It's, it's that close now. I know you spoke on one of like Corey Cadby as well on mm. social media. Oh, You've got a, really, Corey. a yeah, great yeah, relationship yeah. with him, and yeah. he's already got to a major final this year as well. Yeah, yeah, he's great, isn't he? I yeah. love him. I like him because he gives him a bit of stick, and he's got a bit of you know got a bit of bottle about himself, and he is a capable winner. No, definitely. I say we've shown that first year over a UK Open final, which is a great achievement for him. I think he'd be great addition to the Premier League going yeah. forward because he'd give it to him. Oh, he would. He would definitely. And he hasn't frightened anybody. Do you know what I mean? I don't think he's frightened having a little bit of a rough and tumble in the car park with him either. You know, he's one of them players, so he, he has a character and he doesn't take anything serious. You know, you take the mickey out of him, it don't bother him. He just goes, OK, carries on. Mate, again, I'll say we're part of Legends Tour. Are you looking forward to playing this evening in front of that yeah, packed crowd? Yeah, playing Colin, Colin tonight, best of 15, which is a place I haven't played Colin for a while. So, yeah, and he's a lovely kid, Colin. You know what I mean? So it'd be, it'd be difficult to get that grip between your teeth. That takes you back to the match play, I'm guessing, in Blackpool, which yeah, he's had some battles yeah, there yeah, over yeah. the years. But he can still play, I've just been watching him practicing, he's still got it. So He's been playing some hours in the Super yes. League. Yes, I think he has. Well, that's great, Phil. Thank you for taking You're time welcome. out of your busy schedule for us. It's been no an worries. absolute pleasure. Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you.